Sir, we have achieved soft landing on the moon. India is on the moon. Sir. India has created history after ISRO's Chandrayaan-3 successfully landed on Moon's South Pole on 23rd of August. Cheers erupted as Chandrayaan-3's Vikram lander made a successful soft landing. Chandrayaan-3's landing on the lunar South Pole is a big success as India will become the first country to conduct studies of the Moon's South Pole. Chandrayaan-3's rover, Pragyan, will conduct experiments on the geology and origin of the Earth and investigate the presence of water ice. Going to the South Pole is not a child's play. We have really made it happen with the hard work. This region is important because the South Pole of the Moon is expected to have ice deposits and minerals. Sunlight reaches differently at a different angle at the Moon's South Pole, which casts long shadows over the lunar craters. Some of these craters are permanently shadowed, with sunlight never reaching the bottom. Experts believe that these craters could have ancient pocket of ice hidden for a billions of years. Before Chandrayaan-3, India had launched two missions. Chandrayaan-1 and Chandrayaan-2. These missions had detected hydroxyl and water traces on the Moon. Chandrayaan-3's rover will study the presence of water ice on the Moon's surface. If it is found in significant quantities, then water ice could allow future crew missions to set up bases there. Water ice could be used to extract oxygen and fuel. However, no other Moon missions could reach this part of the Moon. Why? Well, because it is difficult to carry out a soft landing on the lunar South Pole. As several countries have earlier made an attempt to land on this part of the moon, no country could succeed. An example of a recent failure was the failure of Russia's Luna 25. The Russian spacecraft was aiming to be the first to land near the South Pole. However, it crashed into the moon after spinning out of control. Uh, going to the South Pole is not a child's play. We have really made it happen with the hard work and the efforts put in by the entire ISRO team and ISRO community. Of course, we have had failures in the past. The Chandrayaan 2 was a failure. But the whatever lessons learned has been used for correcting the Chandrayaan 3, and that is what made the things happen today. And uh, really, it's a highly uh, proud moment for the entire globe. And uh, also, we are shown to the world that uh, we are second to none as far as the space technology is concerned. Uh, in the southern parts of the moon, no other uh, country has landed its probe uh, like India has landed. This is the most wonderful uh, moment of uh, my life, as I can uh, tell you. And uh, I think that uh, this opens the floodgates of research and uh, increased activity in the southern parts of uh, the moon. 